you decided to split the last war into such small pieces when you write about it? Well, it's a heavy going writing one. You know, it takes me so long to write one. I'm not literate, but I came from a working class family. Uh, it takes a long time, you know. The uh, punctuation and spelling takes more time than the words. I mean, I get the words down and uh, take it to the publisher and he doesn't understand it. So what's all this crap? <laughs> Or whatever stopped, you know. So I, I just uh, take a long time to write it, you know. Do you fictionalise the war in any way? No, no, no. My, I, I put a lot of s mad stuff in, you know, like, um, uh, like I, I, I envisage a scene with um, Adolf Hitler and Rommel during the, you know, the air raids when they were bombing him. And I, I thought, well, they must have got the, they must have got the shakes like all of us, you know. And I sort of imagine this big German officer's car the the WC, <laughs> during the bombing. You see, and see, I'd see. Uh, Hitler running in and saying, Rommel, Rommel, <laughs> Rommel, which one are you in? <laughs> I'm in number seven, my Fuhrer. <laughs> Listen to me. You must go to Africa at once. So let me finish going in here first. <laughs> I tell you, <laughs> there's a crisis out there. There's a crisis in here. Oh, oh paper! <laughs> Listen to me, Ronald. Listen, you must get to the bottom of this. I already... <laughs>